What up, hello, Team Saria? Happy Spooky Thursday! You know my channel, Spooky Thursday, that day of the week where I like to tell stories from everything from paranormal to urban legends, and sometimes I just do favorite things and random stuff. And yes, I know I didn't do it last Thursday. I. Mm. So, anyway, if you're new here, like I said, hi, I'm Nikki. I try to do spooky Thursday stories, or s stories of spook, every Thursday. And if you like that type of stuff, hit that subscribe button. And don't forget to hit that little bell icon so you know when I'm, I have, whenever I try to do videos. Like this one. This is the urban legend of Knock Knock Road. And this is downstate in uh, Detroit. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Roselle. Now, for a warning, if I pronounce something, I apologize. I suck. But, you know, it is what it is. So, bear with me. Don't get mad. But anyway, this story of oh, Knock Knock Road, like I said, takes place Detroit in the on Strasburg Road in Detroit slash the Gross Isle area. So put yourself in the mess. Say you're driving down this driving down Strasburg Road and it's a warm night. It's about two so there's like literally no one there or if any. Um and you see you know, you're just driving along, minding your own, and you stop, you know, you come to the stoplight, and you're just blah, 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 and then you look over, you see a little kid, a little girl. You're like, huh, why is this, and then it starts coming, it's like, why is this little girl out by herself, why is she out so late, what's going on? And you kind of turn from that to the, you know, stoplight to see if it's turning, because for some reason it's feel like it's taking forever to turn and you all of a sudden you hear on your well that, that stuff um <laughs> you hear a knocking on your driver's side door and you're like what the heck and you look over you see a little girl looking at you it's here with looking at you with deep set hollow eyes and she said I'm looking for the person I kissed me so I have this road so you're like what the you know but the thing is this story has been this legend actually has been around since, 19, since 1940s and as far as I know from this article it has not really been factual Factual, checked or anything, you know what I mean. Um, there's no, 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 no. There's no news stories or articles that indicate this little girl was killed in this time. So, and the most, it's basically this road is sought after because people want to go there, especially on Halloween, to have a little girl knock on their door and. And say, I'm looking for the person that killed me. The driver that killed me. Now, there's been, re like I was saying, retelling all this stuff since 1940s. And like I said, cops give this particular road during Halloween time a little bit more attention just because. But like I said, there's been, as far as I know, no validation of any of the story. But if you want, go check it out. I dare you. Oh no, I don't dare you, no. <laughs> anyway, yes, I know this video is short and it was probably boring and I apologize, but anyway, I thought it was kind of interesting. I don't know, what do you guys think? Do you think this little girl, there is, a, there was a little girl who was hit by a driver? Look for you for sure. I don't know. Leave in the comments below or find me on everything social medias. And if you have a story of your own, same. 
I love to hear your story, and yeah. So anyway, thanks for hanging out with me and the girl over here who is passed out, sleeping. And remember, just because October's over doesn't mean the spooky isn't. And if you go down the roads that have an urban legend of a little kid, be careful. But anyway, I'll link this article below so you guys can check it out and see what you think. And I will hopefully talk to you guys next Thursday with a new story. Hmm. Anyway, love you guys. Bye.